guys, welcome back. Glass Moon Gaming, another music reaction. And it's time for another Wednesday with a warning. Uh, today I'm bringing you two songs that take us back to the Escape the Mind album. Uh, the first song that I have for you is Eternal Love. And we'll be watching their performance at Lyceo in front of their classmates. Uh, we've watched a few songs from this performance, and each time it's been amazing. It shows their talent at such a young age, and it's incredible. Uh, so let's check out uh, Eternal Love. Make sure you guys check out our Buy Me A Coffee page. It's like Patreon, but with more options. And that's where you'll find the original videos for anything that ended up blocked or edited for YouTube. It's also where you guys can make requests, watch any concert streams you uh, might have missed live on Twitch. Uh, links to the description with all the details. Uh, finally, don't forget, like, subscribe, hit that notification bell. Leave any suggestions in the comment section below. Every little bit helps the channel grow. Let's get to the video, link to the original, in the description, as always. Alright, let's check this out. Ooh, power drum cam. This is definitely an interesting uh, sound for them. It's kind of like modern country in a way. Nothing wrong with that at all. Um, it's doing great so far. Just an unexpected sound. Uh, yeah, I like it. I like it so far. Yeah, one thing about this song is because it's such a a different sound that they've uh, given than they've given us before. Definitely more that country rock feel. Uh, I haven't been listening to the lyrics, so I've been so taken aback by the actual musicianship and what's going on here. Uh, so I, I mean, I can kind of guess by the title of the song what it's about, but I haven't been listening to the lyrics to get that deep into it. And I have a feeling this song is one of those songs that is all about the lyrics. Like, what the song is about. Uh, I mean, yeah, let's go. Let's keep going.
Yeah, I mean, that was a little bridge right in there. Uh, looks sounded like Allie was singing some backup in there. I mean, it's a, it's a good structured song. Uh, the, the, you can see, I like that we can see the, the back of uh, the drum set release the side, which means we can also see out into the audience to see how, uh, what the crowd was really like. Uh, and that's, that's something pretty special for these, for these girls to be able to play in front of, you know, they are their classmates. But that's a decent amount of people still that's in there. And they are still very young in this. Definitely, definitely an interesting song. Totally different than other stuff we've heard from them. Which makes sense from this first album. They're trying to find their way through. really good film. Did we catch that? I mean, that was the very end. It's not like it really mattered too much. But she has her shaker sitting. It could be on the drum there. I don't know. But it has it sitting there. But when she's doing that fill, she drops her stick before picking up the shaker. Don't know if she was supposed to. I'm going to assume not drop it. Uh, but who knows? That might have been planned. But watch. And she had to get rid of the stick anyway. Uh, but yeah. Let's talk. Yeah, so a little bit of different sound coming from the warning there. Some of the real early stuff, obviously. Uh, and you can see that even at that very end, uh, when Pow dropped her stick switching over to the, uh, the shaker, that it was still just as professional as it has been if it was today that she did that. Um, given that I mean, she wasn't going to use the stick anymore in that song, anyway, it wasn't that big of a deal at all. But... Uh, that still shows it. I mean, some people would have freaked out even if it's the very end. It's great, great, great. All right. So, yeah, I'll have to go back and listen to the lyrics again so I can uh, pick up on what the song is actually about and what they're talking about. I mean, like I said, the title probably gives it away. Uh, but, yeah, I mean, I like the song. I like seeing their early, early stuff and how they've matured into the, the stuff that I just saw live in concert a few weeks ago. It's fantastic. All right, we're going to end this one here. Don't forget that I also stream on Twitch. Stop by if you want. You can chat about anything you want. Um, if you're interested in live streaming videos or watching live stream videos and concerts, uh, make sure that you are following me on Twitch uh, so you know when I go live and keep up with my schedule. Uh, link to all my social media, including my Twitch, is down in the description below. Go ahead and follow me if that's something you're into. Uh, don't forget, vote in our Fan Choice Friday poll where you guys decide who I react to every single Friday. Very simple. Go to the community tab, find the poll, uh, vote for the band, whoever wins, that's who I'm going to react to. It's a very simple process. All you have to do is vote, so just go and vote. With that, I hope everyone has a great day, and I will catch you all next time.